Eek, ooch, it hurts. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Cat Wonders here. I am back with five more dresses from Fashion Nova. And I'm excited because the last five that I tried on were spectacular. I got another little variety going on here. Um, this is a three part series. This is part two and I have yet to film part three. That's coming next. So part three will contain six dresses. <laughs> part three will contain six dresses. And uh, I'm excited about that too. I'm saving kind of my favorite looking ones for last, but who knows how they're gonna fit. It's just a mystery. This is not sponsored by Fashion Nova. Um, I paid my own hard-earned money to buy these dresses. Uh, I'm gonna let you know which ones they are just so that you can find them if you want to. And I am excited. Like I said, the first part, if you haven't watched part one, I suggest you watch that one first. Um, but these are gorgeous. Like I'm talking so beautiful, you know, the models on the website are super curvy. I'm not extremely curvy, like I'm not as hippie, <laughs> but um, they seem to be fitting beautifully. So I'm, all of them are size medium and I'm just raring to get these things on. Is that even a say? <laughs> like raring to go uh, and let's just, get straight into the try on. I also want to throw in at the beginning of the video that I do have a Patreon page. And if you're not part of my patron family, one of my wonder cats, then you're missing out. Make sure you check it out. Otherwise you're missing out. Now, beautiful looking dress. Beautiful, super high slit. Um, except for this part here, they must have sewn, just sewn the sequins inward. So like, it's like this. And the sequins are cutting my thigh like a knife. It hurts. I can't move too much because every time I move, it digs in a little bit more. I'm sacrificing my thigh for you guys. I hope you appreciate it. Uh, anyway, eek, ouch. So this would be gorgeous and I would love it if it was more comfortable. I know what I could do if I really wanted to wear this is to put something on the inside of this, like a strip. Um, it's only here, it's nowhere else. This, I think like, have you ever heard of moleskin? Maybe you have, maybe you haven't. It's basically just really kind of soft on one side, it's sticky on the other. So you could kind of put it in your shoes, mainly for inside your shoes, but that's what I would have to do here. It's just this one line. Um, so it was a bit of an oversight on the design team for of the design team of Fashion Nova, but um, this is gorgeous here. I would like to wear some sort of something to make my boobs like this, like this, just like a little bit, like a like an inch in, and it would be perfect. But I feel like I could do that with like just jam something <laughs> either side. And the back is so you can really adjust it however you want to wear it. Zipper here fits me really well. It's just like that one thing. Eek, ooch, it hurts. And nobody wants to be in this much pain on like a night out, you know what I mean? <laughs> All right, let's magically transform into the other one. All right, here we are with this dress. Okay, the idea of this dress, I like the fact that it has sleeves. I love the color. The color is unbelievable. It looks really wonderful on the model, but it's a little big. So this is a size medium. The sleeves are definitely long enough. They're just like a little baggy, right? Which is, you know, not the worst thing. Um, it's I could have gone with a size small. This does fit on the bigger side. Back side here. I guess I should probably try to do that up. Looks beautiful from the back. I think it looks very, very nice. Um, definitely more conservative. I mean, maybe not. <laughs> um, I just think sleeves, I think conservative, but it's definitely sexy. I would certainly need an invisible <laughs> and um, just to kind of like help the girls out a little bit but I think it's really beautiful. Very pretty, very well made, very comfortable. There's no um, itchy spots, scratchy spots. I have like damage on my freaking thigh from the last one. But you know, overall, I find that this is a very nice dress. Um, I wouldn't 
reach for it. I will donate it, but it's still like this color. I'm, I don't know if it's like translating the same. This color is, it's more on the bluey greeny side than what it's showing. It's showing it a little bit washed out, but I love it. I wish that it fit better, but I will be donating it. That's for sure. Oh, and it's called the showing it off maxi gown. And the last one, which I forgot to mention is a family affair. No, what? No, I don't know where the tag is for the other one either. So I'm gonna have to find that one too. <laughs> All right, let's move on to the next one. <sighs> All right, so this lid is super high. To be careful that I don't flash my panties but it is very comfortable, a little short for my liking. I would prefer it to go kind of to the floor, um, but this green velvet, this is the kind of boots that I was talking about that I need. So during my 25 days of lingerie for a Patreon, I was talking about getting like a thigh high pair of green velvet boots, which I couldn't find anywhere. I didn't look too, too hard, but I have red velvet boots which are wonderful, but anyway. Okay, so this has shoulder pads and I'm loving the shoulder pads. I don't know, it just adds an extra bit of dimension. Maybe, am I wrong? <laughs> um, I just feel like they just add a little something, you know? I don't know. But this, I would prefer this to be about, I don't know, six inches longer, eight inches longer, just to the floor. You know, the rest of the dresses are full length. Some of them are even too long for me, but Maybe it's not such a bad thing. You know, you could wear them with boots maybe or wear this with boots. But I think that this is extremely pretty. I am in love with this color and uh, I would buy it in other colors. Maybe it was longer. I think they also make it in like a blue velvet. I'd love this in like a rust color velvet. And the back is just simple, nothing crazy. And this dress would look beautiful with a bright red lip. What do you think? Bright red, a little red and green. Not so much Christmassy, but just like sexy. <laughs> that doesn't make sense, but whatever. Yeah, shoulder pads, man. If those start coming back into style, they've been kind of back in fashion for like a little bit, but you don't see them often. When I was growing up, my mom had shoulder pads in, in her sweaters. Like they were just a thing. So it's a little nostalgic. And yeah, I probably wear it with a bra. Give it more, give it a little more cleave, you know. <laughs> On to the next one. This is such a beautiful color. I, this color, is my dream dress color. It's like Cinderella blue, and I love it. There's a couple things about this dress though that I don't love and that is the way that the top fits. And I'm sad because when I saw this dress, when I pulled it out of the bag, I was like, oh my God, it's gonna be amazing. And it's so comfortable. The length is perfection on me. Hopefully you can see, like perfect, right? Um, the top though, because there's this bit of fabric that goes this way and kind of covers half of this boob. The other one's just kind of left to fend for itself. Unless I sort of, <laughs> um, I would need to wear like a strapless bra. Problem solved, problem solved. I don't typically ever wear strapless bras, which is why I don't own things that I need to wear strapless bras with because then I just don't buy them. Sometimes this happens and you gotta kind of make do with what you got. It's got a zipper back all the way down. It does have like a little, bit of rippling, um, which is, you know, normal, not a big deal. I prefer that it didn't. Um, but this color, I don't know if the color just makes up for the fit. You know what I mean? Like maybe I'm just crazy and it looks totally fine, but I just don't like the way my boobies look. <laughs> I want them to look a little more, you know, alive. Like they have personalities. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, hello. No, I'm not Cinderella, but um, I got nothing. <laughs> very, very stretchy. 
super comfortable. I know I said that already, but I'm saying it again because it's true. And now I'm gonna throw this bad boy on. Look at this dress. It fits me so well. And it is like literally my exact skin tone. If there was a nude dress to be worn by me, it would be this minus the shininess. But this is like, so I'm like mixed on this dress. So I, it fits me beautifully. It actually has some support up here, which like pushes the girls up. So I don't have to wear any type of Invisibra. And um, the slit works perfectly for me. The length is perfect. As you can see, I have like a little bit of a train going on, which I appreciate. And the off the shoulder is beautiful. There's a lot of fabric and I don't know, like I need a full length mirror in here. I don't have one, I've got like a little mirror over there that I always use, but I think that I love it. And I think that it's going to stay in my closet. I don't own anything like this except for a snowsuit. Yes, a snowsuit. Do you want me to show you? Hold on. It's kind of similar. This is a lot more pink, but I mean, I could go from the slopes to a dinner party and look like I didn't change at all. <laughs> the comfort level of this is a 10 out of a 10. The fit of this 10 out of 10, almost like custom, like I had it made for me now, which I have had done before. So I know what that feels like. This is almost like a corset top. So it's got like a lot of structure and I could dance all night in this. And I think that it is pretty much perfection. Um, I either give this dress a five out of 10 or a 10 out of 10. <laughs> I'm just joking. It's probably a 10 out of 10. I just, I love it. If they had other colors. The thing is, I guess it's the color that's throwing me off here. I'm gonna have to review this video later and then decide because I can't really see myself 100%, but like, what do you guys think about the color? Let me know in the comments. It's got kind of like a gold undertone reflect going on, which can work for my skin tone. I don't know, man. <laughs> I need other opinions. Just me in my little studio here. And you wanna wear nude colored undies with this too. That's my only suggestion. And the front fabric is like, front fabric, the top fabric is very nice. This feels great. All right, everyone. I hope that you loved this try on haul. Five more dresses down, six more to go for part three. I was mixed on this haul. So I like the look of all the dresses. One of them cut my thigh to shreds with the scratchy blade-like sequins. <laughs> and then another one didn't fit quite well. Um, I did really like this one. <laughs> so yeah, like the first, Part, like part one went really well. I pretty much loved everything. This one, it's I liked one out of five. So I should say I like two, two out of five because the green velvet did, I did like that one. It was just a little short, but maybe it was just made to be that way. I don't know, but all I know is that quality has been great. Like I said, minus the um, murderous sequins on that one dress, which is a bummer because that blue dress, I love so much, I just, <laughs> No, oh, this doesn't fit me the way that I want it to. You know what I mean? Anyway, so if you're not already following me on Patreon, then you're missing out on the party because there's so much going on over there. Um, way more over there than what's going on on YouTube way sexier than what's going on on YouTube. So if you want to become part of my Wonder Cat family, then head on over there. You can follow me and become one of my little Wonder Cats. I also have an OnlyFans for $5 a month. Make sure that you subscribe so you don't miss part three. <laughs> and also so that you don't miss some of my bikini hauls I got coming up because they are coming, don't worry. I know you guys are like, okay, enough with the dresses, but guess what? I've got some pretty sweet bikinis to try on and we're gonna get to it, don't worry, we will. And uh, I hope all of you are having an amazing day and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.